Hello everyone, my name is Jesse and welcome back to a very special Bakugan video. So, it's pretty early in the morning for me I'm recording this, you might be able to tell in my voice, I'm still getting coffee in me, but I got this amazing idea to watch some of the Bakugan Battle Brawlers commercials, like the OG ones from back in the day, so when I was a kid. Um, so I was like, hey, let's watch them, let's watch them together, and let's react to them, and like, I don't know, maybe I've got some comments on them and stuff like that. Um, so you can search these, they're, they're on YouTube, there's playlists and just random ones. Uh, but this person right here, um, CKG1130, uh, um, he made like an entire montage of them, so I figured, hey, why not watch them and react to them, and uh, I don't know, maybe we'll get some nice nostalgia off of it. Quick reminder, I do want to remind you guys that I do buy and sell Bakugan. You can check out the links below. I have eBay and Mercari down there, whichever you prefer. You can also message me on Instagram or contact me via email for any business inquiries. And if you guys haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. I post Bakugan content usually weekly, if not twice weekly. Uh, so if you're into that, uh, go ahead and subscribe. You won't regret it. Let's go ahead and full screen here. And let's click the play button. Let's begin. Bakugan Battle Brawlers. Bakugan Brawl! Top ranked Bakugan players. Prepare the arena for battle. Arm yourself with a Baku clip. Or present your Baku rack and choose from your collection. The Battle Brawl is on. Now okay, hold on. First, right off the bat. First off, notice they're in like a dojo type setting, I guess. Which is interesting, but the flex, like the the whole idea of flexing your Bakugan, like with the Baku clip or the whole like um, stand, like they got like multiple of them, like the hardcore flexing that's going on is hilarious. Now I think in these computer generated sections, you can see some unreleased Bakugan. We'll see if we can find any of those. Now there are yeah, so right here, let's see if I can go back a frame or two. Yeah, so if you look right here, um, this is the horn, well, yeah, this is the horn for, um, a Ventus, uh, Ultimate Dragonoid, so you can see it right there, so it was, it had the 3D model, it just never had the actual, uh, show version, which is, or like the, it never had the actual toy version, which is super interesting. There are 30 new more powerful Bakugan and hundreds of Bakugan to collect. This is the final stand, only one player will rank number one, Bakugan. There's so many of them. Battle is now. Bakugan Battle Brawler sets an additional- Wait, hold on. When that kid rolled that Dragonoid, did its horn pop out? It did. Hold on. Let's watch this. Number one, Bakugan. The time for battle is now. Oh, it's so edited, Bakugan but okay. Battle Brawler sets an additional accessory- Oh, it just ends. Okay. Bakugan Battle Brawlers. Brawlers, prepare for battle. Play your card wisely and roll with skill. Land on a card to unleash the beast. Dragonoid, how do you roll? The flicker. Top hopper. Backspinner. Now the battle begins. We should try those rolls. You can arm yourself with hundreds of Bakugan brawlers and over 120 cards to collect. Bakugan. Heck yeah. The time for battle is now. Are you ready to roll? Bakugan battle brawlers. Battle packs sold separately. It's interesting to see, um, like... Hold on, these spins and how they use Dragonoid. Because in in some versions, his horn pops out because they want to like show that it does. But then like there's other times it doesn't. Let's see these spins again because this would be interesting to like do and learn. Roll with skill. Land on a cart to unleash the yeah. beast. Dragonoid, how do you roll? Dragonoid. Top popper, back spinner. Now the battle. Flicker, top popper, and back spinner. Okay. Bakugan battle brawler. Interesting font. Arm yourself with new ability cards with over a hundred special commands like okay. power boost or reroll. So now when you go into battle and your opponent thinks he's won, flip the game on him with an ability card. Got decimated right there. Oh, that's clean. Bakugan, the time for battle is now. Look at that kid's smug face. He knew he just flipped that ability card like a boss. <laughs> Oh, wait, let's go back to that one shot of Drago. He got, like, totally owned. Yeah, look at that. He's just on the ground dead from the show. Flip the game on him with an ability okay. Separately. So the, this is a commercial for extra ability cards and stuff, which I guess did happen. Um, You had, like, the booster packs of cards. You can see them online some, too. Sold separately. Bakugan Battle Brawlers. Now you can collect all four Bakugan Deluxe Monsters. Dragonoid. Freyas. Gorum. 
Tigrera. Tigrera. That's cool that you get the um little figurines. I actually have one of Preus right here, which is convenient. I don't think it's it's a huge one. It's like one of the ones you have from like the little toy packs. Um, it would like probably come with a pack with Preus and then his little like dude in it, which is kind of cool. But uh, that's cool that like you kind of I and mean, you can kind of see the same exact uh, little flooring design they put them on. So I can they think that's Skyrus. It's hard to tell because it's so old. Deluxe models and collectible figures each sold separately. Bakugan Battle Brawlers. Bakugan Brawl! Prepare for battle on the new Baku Bowl. Baku Bowl. You can backspin them, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Sort of like in the game. You can do that. They have shots like that in the game. Hand launcher. Hand launcher. Heck yeah. Only one player will rank number one. Bakugan. The time for battle is I kind of want a launcher now. This makes me want one. <laughs> oh. Next season. I dig that. Leafrom looked cool. The world of Bakugan is no longer just round. It's no longer change the around. course of battle with new Bakugan traps and instantly take control. Overpower your enemy with coin scorpion, multi sided metal fencer, or drum pie fantas. Different shapes, different powers. It's a whole different world. I like how you have this like tough dude talking, like narrating it, and he's trying to pronounce all these somewhat complicated names. <laughs> Look at all the kids, man. They have them just in this set. Looks like a basement or some like crazy um like warehouse and they're just all just, like excited about it. Bakugan, new Vestroya. It's a whole new world. New Bakugan are here in Baku Crystal okay. and Baku Steel. There are new traps like Dynamo and Highlash. New special attacks. Higher G power than ever. Ooh. New monsters. And the new Baku Spears. Spears came out here, okay. That's cool, because you can see it progressively, like, upgrade, which is nice. Bakugan, new Vestroya. In battle, it's critical to outmaneuver the enemy. That's why new special attack Bakugan can do powerful There you go. Things. Change attributes with element change. Shock your opponent with spin Dragonoid. I don't know if that's... Or the unpredictable dice thrower. With special attack Bakugan, counter attack in ways. All right, let's see what we got here. So we got Alpha Hydranoid, Nemus, Helios. Um, is that Ingram right there? Is it like a is that a chance Dragonoid right here? I'm not sure. I don't know who this is. Is that Vul uh, Vulcan? Is that right? I think there is Preus too. There's a little bit of. Uh, Elfin right there. So yeah, it's interesting to see them like upgrade now. Um, you can see that you know they advertise higher G power, which is nice, um, and all these different like spinning stuff. Now here's Ch uh, Spin Dragonoid or whatever. I just don't see the spinning as being very battle friendly because um, it's like shock your opponent with a spin Bakugan, but it it doesn't really work. I think I don't know. It's cool though. But yeah, it's interesting how they advertise like. Alpha Hydranoid here, um, with his legs closed and his horn closed, like, you, it's harder to tell what he is. Bakugan, new Vestroya. New Bakugan are here, like Baku Solar and Baku Frost. There are new traps, higher G power, and the new Baku Sphere to store your collection. Hmm. Bakugan, collect, battle, and win. Sets an additional accessory. So that was just another, like, another quick one, being like, there's more new stuff, um, but it's mostly the same. <laughs> Destroyer. Get ready for the ultimate brawler tool. Introducing the Baku Gauntlet. New ways to defeat the enemy. Oh yeah. <laughs> Lock it. Activate. Load it up and gain more G power with an exclusive ability card. Compute your score and add a G power boost. The Baku Gauntlet. Victory is within reach. Okay. So as someone who has played the game occasionally and just uses like my calculator or like pen and paper the gauntlet's pretty cool like i don't know if i would 
I would, mm, I would probably buy it now. But like back then, I would definitely buy it as a kid going to like the Toys R Us or whatever. Hundred percent would want that. That's actually pretty useful. I think that's one of the more useful like side items they sold. Because yeah, you can add up your G power and all that stuff, and you get you your ability cards right in front of you. It's sort of like um, some of the stuff Yu-Gi-Oh did and stuff like that, which is cool. Bakugan, new destroyer. Introducing a group of exclusive traps never seen Okay, we got Max's Dragonoid. Darkhound, the Brachis Hound, Brachius, Spider Fencer, and Brachium. Use them to elevate your game. Yeah. Ignite them. Yeah. To form Max's Dragonoid, <laughs> the ultimate hero. The seven in one Max's Dragonoid set. That's sick. Apart, I love that. Together, other I wonder if we're going to do Helios. Bakugan, new destroyer. Change the battle nope. with Bakugan traps. Another trap one. Like Coin Scorpion, multi-sided metal fencer, and drum pipe fences. Different shapes, different powers. Bakugan yeah, battle brawl sets and additional accessories sold separately. Bakugan got daily an invader. Okay. Unleash a new okay. Next season. Oh yeah, battle gear. All new Bakugan can now walk in battle gear. Weaponized to defeat your enemies like never before. That's definitely a prototype. Amp up your G power with air core. <laughs> Smash your opponent with rock hammer. Yeah. Add extra power with battle turbine. The enemy won't know what hit them. Weapon up for the fight with Bakugan battle gear. Sets an additional accessory sold. Okay, it's cool to see the upgrade. Like throughout watching the commercials, you can see the progression. Like really see it. Um, which is cool because. You know, you get to see the advertising tactics, but you also get to see, like, what changes, what improvements do they do. And then now we're looking back, you know, we're in, we're really, we're in the we're in the future looking at it now. And you can kind of see what really worked and what didn't. Like, I don't think the spin Bakugan in battle really work. They do look cool, though. Um, and then, you know, I just recently got into some of the battle gear stuff. It's cool to see how actually important the battle gear ends up being because, you know... And like I said in my previous videos, they sort of look a little lackluster without the battle gear, but then adding it on looks sick. Now, it is interesting to note that it shows like a prototype of um, uh, Jet Core, but in right here, you can't really see it because it's faded because I got its paused at the wrong moment, but it's it's just a full red Jet Core, which is interesting. We've also gone full HD. <laughs> oh, no, we have not. That was though. Into action with giant auto transforming Bakugan. Oh, we got Decca. Then turn your Bakugan from a ball into a massive oh, wait. monster with amazing detail for the first time ever. This is different. I've never heard of this. Behold the Bakumorph. Bakumorph. Okay, I've not heard of this. Drago and Darak face off in a battle of good versus evil. Transform your Bakugan into the ultimate. Yo, that's cool. Hold up. Bakumorph. Hero with Bakumorph. All right, who do we got here? Hang on. So we've got Derek, Drago. I don't know who that is. Is that Hawksor? I can't tell who this is on the side. Oh, is that Linehalt? Yeah, that's awesome. Sets and additional accessories sold separately. Yo, I kind of want one. Every new Bakugan and Bakugan Battle Gear contains a power never seen before. Okay. Reveal the secret code okay. for free access to Bakugan Dimensions and see your actual Bakugan come to life. That's pretty cool. Store and collect your Bakugan online. Then send your custom avatar to challenge the best brawlers to online battle. <laughs> yeah, it didn't really go that well, did it, though? <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Oh, look how old that computer looks now. Uh, it... Let's go back a little bit. They're, like, fighting. It's terrible, terrible quality. Look how old that computer looks now. <laughs> but, uh, it's it's interesting to, to hear that now, you know, because the, the Bakugan, like, online idea was really cool. It just didn't work. But it's a really interesting idea, especially when it tags along with the third season, because they had a very... You know, you could go and play Bakugan, Baku, Bakugan Inner Space or whatever it is. And um, this is a really cool way to, like, combine that. So if you're watching the show and you're, you know, buying the toys, it's very cool to see that intersect so much. And I love that about the, the Bakugan franchise is they did a lot to intersect the show with the, uh, the, the toy line and everything, which is awesome. 
Um, but you can see, like, you know, now we're fully HD, I guess, you know, full, like, format. Um, but it's interesting to see, like, the progression. Like, you can see, you know, they're, they're getting, like, digital animation and stuff like that. Um, and then you see uh, just, you know, like, there's definitely more things happening, which is really cool. Like, that's sick. Like, the upgrade. Like, you can clearly tell, like, it's very popular at this point in time. That's really cool. Okay. We're at the fourth season now. So now we're at Mechanium Surge. So we're getting, I assume, the diecast stuff and the nanos. It's it's really not fused with, with metal, though. Maybe, like, one small part of it is, but not the bottom. And I hate that because the commercials make it seem like they are fused with metal. That's annoying. <laughs> they roll into battle with more force. Destroy anything that gets in your They way. really All don't though. Made with metal. You can power your Real mold on. Real metal. Yeah, no. <laughs> no. Yeah, maybe like one small part of them is, but like my titanium dragonhoid's got nothing. Metal. You can power your way to victory. Set an additional accessory sold separately. Load, That's pretty cool. Yeah, the battle suits are cool. Transform any Bakugan ball into a powerful battle machine. Battle suit and Bakugan each sold separate. See, this is when I think the game started getting a little bit too much. So you have these battle suits and it just gets too much, I think. You know, there's at this point there's too much toy. Like I said, I think that the battle gear was good like i think we could have gone away with the traps completely don't do those at all but do battle gear that's really cool but then you have the mobile suits which begin to get too much i think personally Unleash a never before seen Bakugan warrior, Mechtagon. Yeah. Swipe to weaponize, swipe to energize, swipe to pulverize your opponent with the world's first fully auto transforming Bakugan action figures. Yeah. I, Mechtagon and Mechtagon Titan, each soul I have one of these and they're really not. I don't know. I don't know if it's because they're old. I have this one, whatever this one's called. I don't know the name of it, but they're really not that. I don't know. I don't like them. They're really not as cool as they, they come out to be. In my opinion, like they're cool at first and then you're like, well, this isn't really a Bakugan. So it's like I can't roll it and it's just like takes up a bunch of space in my opinion. So not a huge fan of these. Like I said, Mechanium Surge came out with some stuff I really just didn't like. New Bakugan Sky Raiders. Jump. Explode. Okay. Soar. Those are the sick. First time ever, Bakugan takes the battle to the sky. Yeah. Land with power and hammer your opponent. You can jump into battle. New Bakugan Sky Raiders. So I do like the Sky Raiders. The Sky Raiders are pretty sick. Um, I, I hear a bunch of people say they have problems with them jumping, like theirs doesn't really jump. I have no problems with that, so I don't know if it's just age or the Bakugan itself or how it's been taken care of, but mine does a fantastic job. You know, jumping and all that stuff. One thing about the commercials, which I've noticed throughout, just thinking about it right now, um, they typically don't show like like in the beginning they showed like Pyrus Dragonoid and all that stuff and Aquas Elfin, but like now we've got like Ventus um, Fusion Dragonoid, which is interesting. You think that because he's Pyrus in the show they'd want to push that, but no, they're totally doing like a bunch of color swaps here. Like we have this, you know, Aquas was at Pyrus. I think that's Chaos or Darkest, but they're all you know, polar opposites of what their normal attribute would be, which is cool. Um, just to show like, hey, like, there's more Bakugan than just in this show. All right, well, that was the end of the video there. It was really cool to see that evolution. But seeing that, like, all the commercials, you know, I remember seeing a couple of them as a kid, but... The advertising is really awesome, you know, it's really energetic and explosive, which I think Bakugan is, um, you know, especially as a kid, that would get me hyped. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed that nice wave of nostalgia, um, I sure did. Uh, if you want to see any more videos like this, I can probably react to like the newer Bakugan commercials, I don't know if there's any more of the old ones. Um, you guys can let me know in the comments, but if you'd like to see me react to more of these, I'd be happy to. Um, just, you know, gotta find different ones, obviously. Uh, but anyways, that's the end of this video. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, feel free to leave a like, drop a comment, and of course, subscribe for more awesome content. My name is Jesse, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.